Congressman Gregory Meek says there is much potential in downtown Jamaica and it's about to get a big boost from developer BRP companies. If people see that others are investing here, as you see BRP investing here now, others will come and they will invest their money. There are a great many people every day who travel through Jamaica. The question is, is there something here that people can stop and stay? Meeks, along with the Greater Jamaica Development Corporation, say they hope a $225 million project that involves residential and commercial development will. The planned tower will stretch along this entire corner and be around 26 stories high. Meredith Marshall of BRP Companies say it will be at least 400 units with market rate and affordable housing. There will also be at least 80,000 square feet of retail and commercial space. Queens is the largest borough. It has the most diverse population, and it has all the economic demographic um, stats that you would want as a development company. Officials say downtown Jamaica's transit options make it attractive and convenient. They say such plans for revitalization have been a long time coming. When I was at Community Board 12, we were talking about developing these sites, and that has been over 20 years ago. And so to see this come together is just wonderful. Jamaica residents say such new development is a step in the right direction. Improvements are always better, so if it's going to give employment and more job opportunities to the people in the neighborhood, that would be good. But they just want to make sure that it's inclusive of all the people in the community. Not just people with money, you know what I mean? I think if they fit uh, low, low income people in, be beautiful. Marshall says he hopes that the construction start in the early part of 2015 and have the project finished within two years. In Jamaica, Agnes Chong, New York One.